This is our last day here in Mexico. It's been a fun week. I feel that this trip went by super fast. It's Friday already and we're leaving tomorrow morning. Early tomorrow morning. We're leaving here at 5 o'clock in the morning. So the kids are going to spend all day in the pool. We're going to have one last dinner for Panchita. Shout out Panchita. We're going to have one last dinner for Panchita. There is a long lineup for breakfast. It's going to be our last breakfast. So eat lots. There's a lineup. A lineup for our breakfast. Jojo's in trouble. No! He broke a snow globe in the shop that cost $130. Pesos. $130 that daddy got to pay for. It's pesos. Now, there's nothing for you. No more swimming for you. You broke something. And food. Until you get home. Earlier it was raining and it was kind of windy, but now it's starting to feel humid. So it's the perfect kind of weather to go into the pool. I'm sure Jojo wants to swim again with his stripy hair. My gosh, we gotta color that hair when we get back. <laughs> cover that ugly now. Is that bird just poop? Get six towel and then go to the infinity. Jo, you know where the infinity pool is? Infinity pool. Um, I know it's near the gym, right? I know where it is. Is that where it is? Okay. Well, I do. Let's go there. I think Jojo didn't drop the expensive one. Yeah, Jojo dropped, like I said earlier, he dropped a... Um, what is it expensive? A snow globe that costs 400 pesos. How much is it? The one he dropped is like 10 bucks. 10 dollars yeah. that he, we don't if even he have. Dropped the, uh, the big one, it would be like, it was, Dad said it was like 400 something pesos. My gosh. Because Jojo, he's so fidgety. If he doesn't have his iPad, iPad he goes crazy. Yeah, there's earlier. no internet access here. What if I drop this? Is it really worth it? mind it's actually pretty windy again right now the waves are strong but the kids are gonna go to the infinity pool apparently the water is warmer there than the other pool so we'll see So we are all kind of sad that it's our last day. Last day though, the weather is pretty windy. They but have we were in the um, we were in the um, kids infinity pool. I didn't know that there was two infinity pools. If only I knew, we would have gone there. Because the water there is so warm. The other pools, obviously, the waters were cold. But this one is here. This one on the side that we were swimming at was really nice. But we're off to just have a light lunch because we're going to have a last dinner before we leave for Panchita's birthday. Another Panchita's birthday. <laughs> Panchita again I'm means I don't know your name. So over there, there is an obstacle game in this cold water. Yeah. That's where everyone is because it's good, but... Say bye, guys. Hey, yeah. What? Say bye. We're going to be leaving here soon. Are you going to miss it here? Look here. Be sad. No, I'm feeling...
clean off my skin. It was dry skin. This is a lava flow. They didn't know what this drink was, so Rocky gave the waiter my phone. <laughs> gave a stranger my phone. But I got it back. It's good. I just finished packing all of our stuff. I'm very sad to be leaving tomorrow. We obviously had such a fun time here in Mexico. Although we wish that the weather would have been much hotter so we could have enjoyed the pool a little bit more than we did. But the kids really did have fun for their first time here. Um, I'm glad that the family enjoyed everything. So I'm just sitting on our patio right now. I didn't, I didn't really have a chance to chill out here because every time we come back to our hotel room, it's like nighttime. But um, the kids are sleeping. Well, the two girls are sleeping. Rocky and Jojo are just out playing ping pong. And like I said, I just finished packing everything. I'm getting ready. Uh, we have our last uh, dinner for our trip. A little fancy dinner for Shara. I'm not sure where we're gonna be eating today. I don't know if it's Mediterranean, or I think we had that the first time. I'm not exactly sure, but we'll find out later. Um, but for now, I'm just gonna be enjoying this weather. Apparently tomorrow, Saturday, it's going to be very, very humid. Not very, very, apparently tomorrow for Saturday, it's going to be a 90% rain. So it's kind of a good thing that we are leaving, but then it's also scary because we're going to be on the plane, but we'll see. Hopefully it's not too crazy, not too much turbulence because I hate plane rides. Here's another overview of our hotel room. Over there. We're gonna miss this room. It's kind of messy. I cleaned it up a bit. We just have a few clothes laying around. Just the clothes that we're gonna be wearing tomorrow. Um, but that's our bed area over there. And we never use this. There's a Murphy bed in here, but there is another Murphy bed in the other room. And that's where the kids were sleeping with my mom. So we left this here as a seating area. Right there. And then over here is our connecting room. And that's the Murphy bed. On our way to dinner. Last dinner of our trip. Say hi. Happy birthday to Panchita. Say hi. It's Panchita's birthday again. Huh? It's Panchita's birthday again. Panchita. Just three Banchita. Some rice and chicken. Sunrise? Rice and chicken. Oh, I thought I said sunrise and chicken. Some rice and chicken. Oh, I thought I said sunrise. 
Keep it sunny. Jojo has another picture. Another picture. Oh. Uh, cheese fries. Mozzarella. Cheese sticks. Fries. And pizza. Everybody is done eating their food and I never got my food yet. But I'm full already. And her so mouth I'm okay. It's going to be swollen. Yeah, as I was walking into the restaurant, something flew into my mouth. I had no idea what it was. It was flat and it was big. And then when it somehow fell out of my mouth, it was salty. My lips were salty. And then my lips started feeling numb. But now it's okay. Like it was tingling, so I have no idea what it was. I don't know if it was um, like a butterfly or something, but it was very weird. Gross. So I thought maybe Rocky was the one who told them it was her name, but then he said he didn't. So now we're gonna wait and find out how they knew her name. Cause this is kind of weird. So how did they know her name? From the uh, reservation. Cause I told them the oldest one. So it's Shara's So it's in the books. Yeah. Bye bye, Mexico, beautiful resort.